So yeah. if you want to go on that side, I'm going to have you deliver treats. Just whenever you hear a click, just go ahead and deliver a treat. And right. Dave, I'm going to be spraying Now I'm giving them something for not doing anything like I did in there. Don't worry, she'll straighten out. <laughs> no, you're not going to do anything. Only when you hear a click. Well, then she clicks. <laughs> See, you can be click? trained too. I just spray you with the water bottle. All right, all right, you want me to give him a treat when I click? I want you to give him a treat when I click. Okay, that's what I said. <laughs>
Hey, keep it, keep it down! It <laughs> <laughs> He's usually out here with the other birds when they get their bath. There's just been nothing positive in it for him. So Any time I've ever tried even a little bit, he runs, he just has run from the water. I thought maybe, you know, he would see the other birds and mm -hmm. realize that, you know, they were enjoying themselves, but. You got a wing I saw that. Mm -hmm. He's like, this yeah, is easy. Mm -hmm. He's starting to associate the sound of the spray bottle with trees. Instead of the spray bottle, I'm getting the hell out of here. <laughs> <laughs> you might be able to get him to come up Maybe. to eat it, yeah. I'm gonna end on that one. I'm gonna let you refill this. Okay. So I'm running out, but he did really well on that one because that time I left the spray going continuously through him getting the treat and even after versus turning it off and letting me give him the treat. He's like, hey, wait, let's do that easy thing where I sit here and you give me treats. <laughs> I know. All right, so this time I'm gonna be trying to spray the stand. So that time I rewarded, you know, the fact that he did flee a little bit, but then he stopped and stayed. That's what I waited for and then left to reward that. The other part of that that I was rewarding was being able to actually get the stand wet because in the past, all those other times, I was spraying the water bottle off to the side, nowhere near him. This time, it's actually making contact with what he is on. Although he still can't feel the water, it's gotten a lot closer, which I'm also rewarding for. So now that I've soaked the entire stand, at least the lower part of it, uh, he climbs down to go to his hiding spot, but then realizes there's no tray there to protect him from the water, and the whole stand is wet. Wet enough to just be dripping a little bit. If you really see on the right side, that's dripping a lot, but the other parts are just dripping barely a little bit. And he's actually moved to a point where he's getting wet by it. So he was kind of rudely surprised about that. Where are you going? You need a bath. You need a bath. It almost might be better to have him in the cage. In one of these small ones. Do we want to do that? Put him in there? Because I don't want him to feel like it's total punishment either. Like he can't totally get away. Because right now he's choosing to go into it. If I use the cage, I'll have less control over it. And I'll yeah. have to get him wet. Whereas right now I'm spraying below him and he's going into it. Yeah, I'm just throwing different oh, thoughts. Yeah. I don't know. Yeah, he's choosing to get into the water and then getting upset about it. Hey, Cree. So, yeah. yeah I mean, you know what I mean? Like, so if he right stays there, here, right, he would stay dry. It, he would stay dry. Mm -hmm. But he's going through the water. So, yeah, I kind of feel like maybe we should move on to inside the cage. And I can try that. And just don't push as hard, but. Yeah. Did 
Did it get him? I think so. Yep, just a little bit. As long as I can see it on top of his head. That was no reaction. He definitely got wet, right? Mm -hmm. Yep, I got wet. <laughs> <laughs> well, that was really good. That was no reaction at all. It's kind of shocking. Boy. The sound startled him, but the water didn't bug him. That was, yeah. yeah. Can I open the gauge and let it crawl out by itself? No, I wouldn't yet, because I just got that good response. I might be able to get it more. Oops. <laughs> if I'm paying attention. I think he's wanting to it. Yeah. Nice. Yay! Yeah. 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 That was a beating response. Yay! Good. I feel like you can also do it while he's eating. Yeah. Whereas I had him right there, and he was doing really good. Wasn't too bad. I'm gonna shake again. Yes, we got him and we had to wean him. Okay. He's the first one we bought, him and Rick. We're going to call her Rick One. She's the one that passed away. And when we first got these two, we may have made a mistake of putting them in the shower like we were told and giving them baths. And so he may have been traumatized from that because mm -hmm. they were that young. That was a one-time thing. It, but I know, but what they said, they remember. So yeah. I don't know. It was, it was a one-time thing because they were running around the bottom of the shower. <laughs> going out they didn't happy. want any part of that. Mm -hmm. okay. And so we dried them off. We never gave them a bath again. So normally I like to click when they're totally calm. I'm not really going to get totally calm from him. So what I am rewarding is not fleeing, not making a big deal about it. So I'm rewarding very small reaction. I, I, ideally I want no reaction. I want him to just let the water fall and not move about it. But since he's not running away or making a big deal out of it, I'm going for that right now. And seeing him get so, so the goals are going to change as he as he gets as accustomed he, to it. So right. if the new thing is like, yeah, he'll just sit there and we can spray this over, then it then it'll okay. change to like, okay, I want like a little bit of a bathing response. I want I don't even want that little movement. You know, I want him to just sit there and understand that if I just sit here, water drops on me, a treat's coming, and so he should anticipate that and eventually look forward to it. So I think there he's finally starting to understand. I take this, I get this. Good job.
not running. Exactly. I would say like your all your birds, your whole flock just kind of needs a boot camp on desensitization, just getting them, you know, to be more confident. Birds more used to things, understanding these things are not horrible, they're not going to kill them, there's nothing bad about them. Good job! Actually getting more bathing responses too. Yeah, good job. Slippery one. There you go. It's actually becoming more content. You can just see he's like a little bit more fluffed and content looking. Good job. Pushed him a little harder that time. Or you could see he's uncomfortable enough that he thought about ditching me. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> but then he made the decision to be like, actually, it's not burning me. Cool. To reiterate, this is harder than we want you guys to push. Yeah, I never want you to have this long of a session. I never want you to push this hard. I would rather you guys have shorter sessions that were like, yeah, that went great, and just keep doing that day after day. We we're just trying to make kind of turbocharged progress for you guys in one day. Damn it. I think she's coming closer for a treat. She's uh, like, look, I'm putting up with this. You better give me some. So if he fluffs up, I'll give it to him, but otherwise I'm going to wait for him to go back. <laughs> And the reason I'm rewarding like the fluffing up is that's a bathing response. So a lot of birds will do that. And so I want him, I want him to bathe. So anything that's around that I'm rewarding. Good. That's what you see in a bird that's not usually scared to bathe. There you go. Morning, morning. Morning. He's, He's might full. full. <laughs> full. Alright. He's like, oh, well, I'll take it. I think we're probably done. Done? Yeah. That was really good progress for a day. If you guys kind of can do that together, yeah. and I think it would work well to have whoever's better at reading his body language do the spraying and the clicking, and the mm -hmm. other person just gives a reward. Okay. And this is the only time he gets banana, is for bathing training, okay. not for any other kind of training, just bathing. Yep. And then once he's awesome at bathing and he doesn't need the reinforcement for it anymore, use that banana for the next big problem that you have with him. Okay. Good job, bud. That was cool. The other thing I would say for your entire flock is just rewarding the calm, content looking body language all the time. Just to mellow everybody out, especially these two. I'd like to see them a little bit more calm with life versus the anxious, 